टुडे वी डिस्कस गॉस क्लियर Electric flux linked with the surface when closing a charge is equal to one by epsilon zero times the charge enclosed by the surface. That is, if I assume flux as phi, that phi will be equal to one by epsilon zero times the charge Q enclosed by the surface. In short. Flux phi equal to q by epsilon zero. Now, this epsilon zero is because we assume that the charge is in air or free space. If the charge is kept in any other medium other than air or free space, then flux related to that medium will be equal to the charge q divided by epsilon. Here, the epsilon is the permittivity of the medium. This is, in short, the Gauss's theorem states. Now, the charge we assume here is the total charge enclosed by the surface. We studied that charges are of additive in nature. That is, suppose we consider a group of charges having positive and negative charges together. Then we add all the charges to get the total charge and to explain the Gauss's theorem. Let us see some examples. Example one. Suppose I have a sphere that is enclosing charges capital Q and capital Q two Q minus four Q like that. A group of charges. Then the electric flux linked with the surface will be equal to flux phi, which is equal to total charge Q total divided by epsilon zero. Now that will be equal to plus Q plus plus two Q plus minus four Q. Whole divided by epsilon. That will be equal to adding all the charges as we do the number addition and subtraction. We get Q plus two Q three Q minus four Q. That is minus Q remains and by epsilon C. So this is the flux linked with that sphere enclosing these charges. Understood?